Hello and welcome to a new EasyDigitals.com video tutorial. Remember, you can get all of our high quality Photoshop and Photoshop Elements templates at EasyDigitals.com. Just click on the Products button. And don't forget to sign up for our monthly newsletter. We give away free templates and tutorials each and every month, along with product update info and coupons. Okay, Kim, what easy tutorial are you going to show us today? Okay, so now we've made modifications to this template, and I've went ahead and desaturated and turned the other layers to black and white. And there's one final step you need to do if you do not need the bleed on this, which is shown here with these guides. Basically, there's a couple ways that you can reduce it. One of the easiest ways is I like to go to View, Snap To, and make sure Guides is checked marked, and you click it if it's not checked marked. And then you just come over to your Crop Tool, and your Crop Tool will snap to these guides, and it makes it real easy to, you can just kind of make sure it snaps to it. And then you just right click and crop. Now, if you do Image, image size. It's somewhere around 5 by 7. It's not always perfect. So that's why, the, which this would probably be okay for printing, but there is another way to make sure that it's 5 by 7, and I'm going to show you that way next. So I'm going to come over to my history and go ahead and undo that. And I still have my snap to guides turned on, and I'm just going to come over here to the width. As long as my crop is selected, I press 7. I N 5 I N. So that's going to make it 7 and 5 inches high. The resolution I'm going to leave blank so that it stays the way it is. And I can either crop to my guides and it will be 5 by 7 or I, if I want more space around it I can actually make it bigger. And then you can use your arrow keys to make it and just then you right click and crop and it's cropping it and then if you don't want to see these guides anymore you can, you can just come up to view and clear guides and the guides are gone and it's ready for print one more thing you can do with this if you download the font that comes with it is you can change this to say anything you want or you could change this text to say a person's name or whatever you want. So this could be used for anything, not just for a senior. Enjoy the template. Hey, that was easy. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about this tutorial or any of our products, you can always reach us at easydigitals.com. Have a creative day.